Say swa. <laughs> Welcome. And today we're making sliders and meatballs because guess what? They're basically the same thing. The best sliders are meatball. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We didn't do this exactly right, okay, but I've got a pound and a half of pork. This is 85.15. The more fat, the better. Okay, say that. The, the more, more fat, fat, the better. <laughs> oh, I didn't okay. catch that. You gotta do that. Again. The more fat, the better. Okay, all right, so I got a pound and a half of pork, and this is 80.20 on the ground beef, and I only got a pound because they didn't have a package that was a pound and a half, but I like to do 50-50 on this. So a pound, pound and a half, okay? So we're gonna put that together. All right, oops, don't get crazy. Oh, let's stop already, okay? Oops, hands. Oh, <laughs> we're gonna check out the other ingredients you have. Diced red onion, some cubed, what kind of cheese is this? Uh, jalapeno, yeah. So here we go. So three eggs. Like pepper jack? Like pepper jack cheese. There you go. There's one. So an egg for every pound, okay? Mm. We got almost three pounds of meat in there. Let's get three eggs in there going. Okay, we did good. We didn't get any shell in there. Hey, oh. at least a cup of this. There you go. Oh my All right, there you go. We got that, okay? And, oh yeah, fresh onions. About how much is that? I would say one, a cup. One red no, onion? It's a smallish one. Uh, I did a more than half of a, a medium sized one, so. More than a, half? More than, a little more than half. I figure it was about a cup. Uh, oh yeah, look at this. How's it going so far? You know why we're doing this? Because we want to have spaghetti with the sauce and meatballs. And we want to have sliders. Look, whatever you don't eat. Not on the same night, right? Not on the same <laughs> night. Look at that. That's going to be the size of my little hamburger. And what is that? That's a little, like biscuit a Biscuit cutter. A biscuit cutter. All right. So let me do this and then I'm gonna divide it in two and then we'll season each one, all right? Let's just go for it. So this is the base of... Yeah. We're not gonna over mix this. We're not gonna do it too much, okay? We're gonna just get it in here and then I'm just gonna cut it right in half here, okay? Okay, there's that. I didn't make too much of a mess there. Look at that. There is about half of that. So there's that. Here's this half. Now you've got a perfect amount to make some meatballs and um, lighter. She's got Izzy eating her dinner. <laughs> Come on, is that where we are in the show right now? <laughs> we need a commercial break. Oh, maybe I should stop to wash my hands. All right. Let's go over here to the sliders. This is that cheese. Look at that cheese. Ba ching 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 cha ching. <laughs> oh, oh, wait a minute. We can't forget about the cheese for this. <laughs> I don't want to film. There we go. Look at that. Okay, so we got feta cheese over here. A little bit of parmesan. Okay. Look at this. We got two things going. Oh yeah, that's good. Okay. Now. Italian seasoning. Oh, do I look happy? Mm -hmm. Frick yeah, I'm whistling Dixie. Anybody who says money can't buy happiness, never had any. Look at this grin, ear to ear, baby. Okay, I don't know why I said that. Okay, all right. You gonna there. tell us what that is? This is granulated garlic. Okay, we got that in there. We got that in there. How about a little bit of this? Gosh, how do I open this? This is dumb. In the hill, 15. <laughs> this has never even been opened. And what is that? This is celery salt. Apparently we've never even used it before. All right, and a little Greek freak. There we go, look at that. Greek just, freak has, yeah, just, let me read the ingredients. Okay, read the ingredients. 
Hey. Oh, actually, I'll show it to you. Okay, here we go. Oh. Spices are oh. those, and this is what it looks like. All right, now on this side, I need a spoon. Okay, just guess what we got over here? Some special hot bacon jam. And this smells like, almost Let's like a barbecue. Label. Oh yeah. Yeah. So I'm just gonna put a spoonful of that in there. A little bit more than a spoon. <laughs> spoon and a half. Okay. Not a tablespoon, just a spoon. All right. Oh, look at this stuff. This is my uh, seasoning. <laughs> What's that? And this one's called black. I'll show. Black bean, blue, blue bayou. Black and blue. Oh yeah. Okay, there's that. And a little bit of pepper on both. Okay, added more garlic to that one, or added garlic to that. Oh one. shoot! I already had. Did I already have it in there? No, no. no. All right, yeah, yeah. Put some garlic in there. Fresh cracked pepper. Fresh cracked pepper. Okay, both of these are ready to go. Okay. And you so, didn't salt them because why? Uh, because there was plenty of salt in all the other things. So Celery salt and the other seasonings. Yeah. Oh, but you're going to do it anyway. Yeah, because <laughs> guess what? She always said, put more salt in there. <laughs> you're not going to have a heart attack if you don't get some more salt in there. All right, there's that. Okay. Now, if you're making burgers, guess what else we got to make? We got to make some Cajun fries here. So let's get the air fryer going, right? Air fryer. Let's get this up. Ooh, ha, ha. Okay, so we're making fries. Let's get these fries going here, okay? Everything needs to cook about the same amount of time, okay? So I'm putting oil in there, and then we're gonna add salt. So I'm make sure my hands are clean, okay? Clean hands and a pure heart. Right here on the Easy Kitchen, okay? Hey, it's easy. It's, I don't know why people don't come home from work after working their butts off all day and cook, because it's easy. But you know what? You can do this on Saturday. Guess what we're gonna do with a lot of this food here? We're gonna freeze it, and we're gonna pull it out and have awesome food whenever. I, we had some sliders left over last time, and they were just awesome. So, make sure you got plenty of oil on there. Oh, do you hear that? That means that's <laughs> ready to go. Uh-oh, my special seasoning. <laughs> Uh, there it is. Good thing I got a camera person that knows what's going on here. Oh, you know what this is? This is what's going to ruin somebody. Oh, yeah. Cajun. Cajun freaking seasoning. Okay, there's that. Okay, there's that. Okay, there's that. All right. Where'd you put That's the salt? What, where did I put it? Yeah. Put it back. I must have put it back. Because we need some now. Okay, there we go. Okay, here's this. Spread, look at that bowl. Get these spread out there. Okay. Okay, look at that. They're spread out, they're nice. Okay, we're gonna throw them in there. Okay. Once these, I put them in there for, uh, it'll take them about 20 minutes to cook, okay? And once they're about uh, 10, 12 minutes in, what I'll do is I'll take them, shake them, make sure I get uh, plenty of stuff on there, uh, seasoning in that, okay? And then put them back in to finish up there, okay? Now, oh, I don't need to wash this. This is just seasoning. All right, here goes, this is our, Italian meatball, okay? Now, it's hard not to overdo this, but don't overdo it, okay? That is a lot of feta, babe. Hey, guess what? These are, if you need more fat, okay? Like it feels too dry, <whistles> olive oil. Get some more in there, there you go, okay? And you can do this by feel, okay? Just get a feel for it. Be adventurous. Watch the Food Network. You know what I mean? Yeah, just go for it. 
Look at these little things there. Now that looks freaking awesome. Okay. All right. Not too big. Okay. How's that look? Does that look good? Oh. As far as the size, yeah. Yeah, almost like meatball like that? Mm-hmm. Okay. There we go. Okay. Now, I'm going to switch gears here in a second and do the other one. Because i got to show you how the... We do this, okay? You don't have to watch me make 50 meatballs, okay? So here we go. So there's two, all right? Can I get them about the same size, okay? See they're wrong? Just fix it. Fix it. Okay, there we go. So there's a couple of meatballs, okay? There's a couple of meatballs. Okay, you're gonna put them on there. Put them apart, okay? And we're gonna drizzle some uh, olive oil over the top of them, okay? Oh, this is the other one. Look at this. Just totally different. But it's the same thing. It's beef. It's pork. It's cheese. And it's yum yums. Look at this. Now here, here we're going to have some fun here. Okay, we're going to make a burger. Mmm. These smell good. Do they smell good? Mm -hmm. You can smell that bacon jam, whatever that is. All right. Okay. So here's what it smells like, like barbecue sauce, basically. Right, so if you don't do have that this. bacon jam, you can totally put barbecue sauce in it. All right. What I do is I'm trying to get this to be the exact size of my little bun there. Okay. So there we go. Okay. And uh, there it is. Okay. So there we go. All right. So I'm going to finish this part up, throw it in the oven, and then we're going to come back and see what we got here. I've been very busy while you've been gone. <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, I forgot something. I usually will. Did I put oil on there? No, it doesn't need it. Look it at all that. It didn't need it. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to take three of these burgers. So and what do you call what you just did? I kind of just par bake them is all. Oh, look at this. Look at this. And that's my little griddler. You can throw them on the grill and get grill marks, but hey, that's just me. I, I got a little griddler. I'm doing that. Check this out. Check out my cheese. Look at this. Yeah, we use this little thing to cut the lettuce, to cut the cheese. The tomatoes are exact size of these buns. Look at these buns. They're ready to go. Oh, fry sauce. That must mean we have fries. Come on over here. Get a hot pad. Oh, look at these little babies. Ha ha ha. Let's see if they're any good. Oh, yes. Mmm. Mmm. Don't double dip. Don't double dip. <laughs> All right. And? Meatballs are still going. So we're gonna let those go a little bit longer. We're cooking those 20 minutes, whereas the burgers, we probably did them, I did them a little longer this time. Usually wanna do them 12, but I think we probably did a little closer to 15 on them. And that's okay. And these things are grilling up. As soon as I get some grill marks on there going, I'm throwing the cheese on, it'll melt. I'll leave the lid open, let the cheese melt on it. We're gonna make our buns up right now. And we're getting ready to have just sliders and fries. And then tomorrow, we're gonna eat spaghetti and meatballs. The world's best slider is a meatball. Thanks, it's tomorrow. And here are our spaghetti noodles. They're ready to go, okay? And we took our little yum yums, little meatballs. Why? Because the best slider is a meatball. <laughs> and now we're going to have... We're going to have spaghetti and meatballs. Oh my gosh. All right. Ooh, just get me out. All right. We're going to top it with some cheese, but it got put away. It's the saddest part of my life right now. And, hey, this is out, so I'm using it. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, and we're gonna have. Look at that. 
spaghetti and meatballs because the best slider is a meatball and now we eat two meals. I've got extra meatballs left over. They're in the freezer already. I've got extra sliders left over. So this is stuff you could do on a weekend and then you have food for the week. Okay, like and subscribe. Bye now.